I like to paint objects that are not just random canvases that are just square white objects. I like to paint things that already have a soul. That's why I paint you skateboards and that's why a boombox, you know. You belong to the street gang, you did, you know. I was destructive. Story properly, <laughs> you were destructive. Uh, there was, there was a, a big fight that ended badly at one point. Uh, mm -hmm. So you're thinking that perhaps that came from some... Uh, I think there was some frustration that came from somewhere before. It was just always there, even when I was like very little, even barely being able to talk, I was already like biting people's ankles and <laughs> there was a, an anger that came into my blueprint, but uh, I think I dealt with it mostly. And then as you rise up, you got my wife who's like my healer and then on top you got the more uh, faceless third eye part of God that's like a fractal sun flower shining the light of consciousness and its hands are pushing the clouds of confusion and mind to the side to let that light shine through. Yeah. What is your art saying now about what, where you are? <sighs> hmm. Well, life keeps evolving uh, and then the art evolves with it and uh, whatever the episodes in my life like getting married uh, do to me inside, it will come out onto the painting and I don't intellectualize it too much where I'm like because I feel like this I should do this I just sort of do it and it's later the painting that te teaches me where I'm at inside and it's like oh yeah that's how I'm feeling cool great it's interesting